Prince Andrew wants to do another interview to stave off criticism from his controversial Newsnight interview, a source has claimed. The Duke of York is considering speaking to the press again to put right what he didn't say in the first interview, one source suggested. The unnamed source told Vanity Fair, there are rumors swirling that Andrew wants to do another interview. Andrew hasn't drawn a line under it. He wants the chance to put right the things he didn't say. Newsnight gave him the chance to show some remorse. He was asked if there was anything else he wanted to say. It was an open goal, he didn't grasp it, and I think he sees that now. Buckingham Palace told Vanity Fair it was not aware of any interview in the pipeline. On Saturday, the BBC aired the interview which was meant to set the record straight over Andrew's relationship with convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein and claims by Virginia Roberts, who said she had sex with the Duke. But Prince Andrew failed to express sympathy for Epstein's victims and said he didn't regret his friendship with the former financier, as it opened up opportunities he may not have had otherwise. Asked by presenter Emily Maitlis whether he regretted the friendship, Andrew said, Now, still not and the reason being is that the people that I met and the opportunities that I was given to learn either by him or because of him were actually very useful. He himself not, as it were, as close as you might think, we weren't that close. So therefore I mean yes I would go and stay in his house but that was because of his girlfriend, not because of him. Ms. Maylis told The Times earlier this week she found Andrew's words on the friendship with Epstein breathtaking. Following the interview, several partners of the Duke's entrepreneurship scheme pitch at Palace and some of his patronages have either severed links with Andrew or announced they will review their relationship with him. Today, BT Group suggested they would no longer work with IDEA, one of Andrew's projects, until the organization changes patron. In a statement, BT said, in light of recent developments we are reviewing our relationship with the organization and hope that we might be able to work further with them, in the event of a change in their patronage. The student union at Huddersfield University voted to campaign to see Prince Andrew stepping down as Chancellor of the Institute. And the Board of Trustees at Outward Bound UK, a charity Andrew became a patron of in March, is to meet to discuss the future of the Duke as patron. Princess Beatrice is a member of the board but, as confirmed to Express.co.uk by a spokeswoman of the charity, she won't take part in the meeting to avoid a conflict of interest. Yesterday Prince Andrew attended a crisis summit at Buckingham Palace, according to a source, after pulling out of the first official engagement since Saturday. They told The Sun, this has become the biggest royal crisis in a generation and it's hard to see it going away any time soon. He was at Buckingham Palace for some sort of crisis summit yesterday. It's dawned on him just how bad things are.